Well, the city of Billings transitioned to a new utility billing software in June of this year. Due to this shift, city staff began seeing issues leading to a delay of certain bills being issued to city residents. And for many in this city, they saw a lump total sum of a 60 day bill or in some cases a 90 day bill. Good Monday evening everyone. Thank you for joining us. My name is John Martin. Now all of this led to citywide confusion and of course frustration as residents trying to wrap their heads around what appeared to be a massive water usage. As a result, the city of Billings is hosting a special work session tonight to help residents understand and to ask questions. Ren Wadsworth is there ahead of time. She joins us now live and uh, Ren, what can we expect from this special session that begins in about 30 minutes? That's right, John. For several weeks, residents took to social media to try and understand their water bills. And tonight, city officials plan to dissect this very problem. Now, residents who attend and give their permission will have their data and bills looked over by staff. The city hopes that by showing real life examples, customers will better understand where and how their water usage has changed and why they might be seeing higher bills now. Public Works also hopes to go in depth on the new software, some of its pitfalls and help attendees better understand the current situation. While the situation persists, however, the city administrator is asking the people for patience. The folks who are answering the phone, they are trying to help customers get the information uh, to understand what's happening with their bills and do that to the, the best of their ability. And I would ask anybody to put themselves in someone else's shoes. Let's be respectful of each other, kind. Ask your questions. We owe you answers to those questions. But there are some things we've seen that just are completely dishonest out there too. The city says from the thousands of bills that they've received so far, they've seen, quote, no errors and believe the cost people are paying are accurate. The city stands by the water usage amounts people are seeing and are willing to submit to an audit if needed to help regain people's trust. The meeting will finish with a forum where attendees are encouraged to ask any questions that they still might have. And that meeting will be held here at the city council chamber meet chamber. Uh, and that's going to start at 530 reporting live. I'm Ren Wadsworth. Back to you, John. Ren Wadsworth, thank you very much.